Hang on, I haven't done a trick yet. I'm, I'm not a beggar, I'm a magician. Take this back. This is not a begging scenario. You can't give me that till you've seen a trick. No, I'm not going yet. Thank you. To the power of 92. And so, if we subtract that original 43, we find that the number that you are now thinking of is 3.75. Am I right? <laughs> So it, it's really good to meet you. Thanks so much for coming down. And w with all your experience, I'm, sh I'm sure you'll be familiar with everything in the act. There are certain things I will not do. I will not be chained, manacled, incarcerated. I will not be cut, endangered or imperiled. I will not be silent. I will not be patronised. And I will require equal billing. And you were born in 1932? No, I am 32. You're 32? That's right. I'm 32 years old. Right, well, that, that was brilliant. This is all brilliant. Um, there's just one thing I, I should... Not a big thing, I should probably mention before we talk about the travel arrangements. Um, I, I did chop my last assistant's head off with a guillotine. Anyway... Clark! Don't say anything now, just um, ha have a think and, and no, see what you... I don't think I can do this, OK? Oh, Jesus, not again. And who is that? Who is texting you direct? I'm the agent. I'm the gatekeeper. Oh, it's Danny. You know, the TV coffee person. That's funny. <laughs> Do you think that's funny? Um, it doesn't mean anything. Well, it relates to something I sent her. No. Well, it does. Well, let's not argue, Carl, shall we? And just remember, your little problem since Carol you don't want to be writing any cheques you can't cash with your cock. I mean, people need magic. I mean, where's the magic in modern life? Where's the mystery in a nail bar or a key cutting place? I suppose that is a bit mysterious how they actually cut the keys, but you know what I mean. Hey, no, you're totally. So that's why I've decided. I've had a big think about it, and I've decided to go to Jersey to enter the shield with Harry. What? You've, what the fuck? You've been thinking about it? What kind of partnership do we have if you go around thinking things privately in your own head? Well, I told you as soon as I decided. As soon as you decided? What, so you decided five seconds ago? Well, not exactly five seconds ago. Not exactly five seconds ago. There you go. Now it's all coming out, isn't it? So when did you decide? Was it on the bus? Was it in Costa Coffee? Well, I suppose I finally made up my mind about half an hour ago. Half an hour? And you've kept this little bombshell to yourself for 30 whole minutes, have you, Carl? You're quite the secret squirrel, aren't you? Come on. What do you want, Dad? What do I want? I, I don't necessarily want something, Dwight. I just came down to say hi. Oh, oh sorry, there is something I do quite want. You know that flower vanish? You know, could I have one, you know, like, for free on the house? That's a 90-quid illusion, Dad, and you can only use it once. Jesus, how many have you sold? None, but, you know, I'm biding my time. Everyone that sees it freaks. Right, right. Yeah, well, I don't carry that kind of wad around with me, so, uh, can I have one? No. Oh, just give me one or you're grounded. No. <laughs> oh, come on, son. Look, if I win, think how many you'll sell, huh? Everyone in Magic is going to be chanting the name Dwight White. Not in a way those kids did at primary, yeah? In a nice, lucrative way, yeah? Simon Smallcock, wanting to know why I'm not at the shop. You didn't ask for time off? No, no, I thought if I asked he might say no. Oh, right. Good point. Anyway, screw him. I'm never going back there. Linda, I... Uh, 
Listen, there's every chance that we'll have a promising professional future, but you should know magic's not what it used to be. The gold rush is over. Daniel's mined it all in the 80s Relax. and... Harry. Okay, it's not all about you. All right, if it doesn't work out, I'll just find something else. No, I'd probably do my book or snorkel for cash in Malaysia. You know, I'm just, just a ride, yeah? I'm riding you. Oh, uh, okay, great. Well, I'm glad we cleared that up. <laughs>